Yo, what is going on guys? Johnny GB with the Token Minorities, bringing you guys a Pokemon TCGO deck profile, something I have not done for the channel in quite a while. So, um, it's been a while since I've done any type of deck profile, Sword and Shield and Rebel Clash, second Sword and Shield set, both have released. Um, I haven't really done too much with those. I did open a Zacian V10 on the channel a couple days ago. Uh, but, uh, what have they, what have they been, Sunday? Yeah, Sunday I did an upload. This will go up on Tuesday, and then I'll hopefully have another one for you on Thursday. Try to do three uploads for you guys a week. Um, if I have to, I'll have to do a theme deck review. Uh, so I'll do one video of unboxing a theme, uh, one of the theme decks that you can buy right now. I believe the Zashi and Zash, uh, Zamazenta tins are available right now. So I might have to review those uh, for new players and kind of just uh, use those in a theme deck tournament or something like that uh, in case there's no other real product or deck profiles I can really make. So, we're gonna go to the deck manager. I should have a couple here though that we can go. I got three that I do wanna go over that uh, I actually have built in real life. So that's one that I'm kind of familiar with these. Uh, but you guys saw by the thumbnail, the one we are going over today is more Pico. So, I do want to get rid of one card. Um, you. So, more Pico V, one of my favorite decks from Sword and Shield. So, I am a little late to the party. I know you have a lot of fancy stuff like Dragapult G, uh, Dragapult V, V Max. Um, I believe there's a couple other decks, but these are the decks that I'm actually happy with in using. Um, more Pico V just is one of those fun, hard to kill decks because you play it with. Uh, Lily's Poke Doll. Lily's Poke Doll, just one of the very staple stall cards to use in the format uh, that you can search easily, which is fantastic. A lot of ways you can search it. But more Pico V, if we look at its attack, you're pretty much using Electro Wheel, which you discard an energy. Cool, who cares? We have ways to get energy back, but it does 150 damage, and you just switch it with one of your bench Pokemon, which more than likely is going to be that Lily's Poke Doll. So your opponent's always continuously having to swap. If they knock out the Lily's Poke Doll, most of the time it has Lucky Egg attached, so I am getting seven cards. And then I go back to more Pico V, probably picking up a knockout with another 150 damage. And then I'm back into a Lily's Poke Doll. But then we can go into the more Pico V Max, where we have Max Discharge. So we're doing 180, which knocks out a lot of just regular V. But then we're doing 20 to each of the bench Pokemon. Spread damage, very good right now in the format. I like being able to spread damage across. But... We're not just locked into this because we have the ability with uh, memory energy. Memory energy lets me use one of my previous uh, forms attacks or, or previous evolution. So since we're evolving from a V to a V max, it does give me access to electro wheel and I can keep recycle energy. So you're probably using four energy sometimes on more Pico V because you are using recycle and memory energy on one recycle energy if we take a look at it just a very good energy card uh, for more pico if it's used to be discarded from an attack you just add it right back to your hand you reattach it you use uh electro wheel again and then some of the other cards that we have in the deck tapu coco prism star so this is kind of just your standard electric staple card uh put it onto your bench you put it to the lost zone and then from there you do get Two energy attached to your Pokemon. Uh, four Jirachi into the deck. So these are the Jirachi from the... What is it? The League Battle decks. Uh, if you haven't picked one up already, go pick one up. That is such a good deck to have. Uh, getting four copies of Jirachi for 25 bucks. You get also a Tapu Koko Prism Star. You get a Zapdos. You get a bunch of good stuff. Uh, we have one Tapu Koko V. So Spike Draw. Very good opening attack. Uh, just draw two cards, 20 damage. It's fine. Free retreat, though, is the big thing. You want free retreat. Then we also have Absol. Absol causes our opponents put basic Pokemon to have one more retreat cost, so harder for them to swap out. We also have Mimikyu, so any of our opponents' GXs that have abilities, we remove those. Now, Mimikyu is an expendable card in this deck with a lot of people running Vs. Uh, Mimikyu really just serves no purpose and probably I will look at replacing here in the future. And then we can look at Oricorio GX. Oricorio GX I absolutely love. 
Dance of Tribute. So if you're poke, if you have a Pokemon that was knocked out, you can draw three cards. So only can use it once per turn. But when you have something like a Lily's Poke Doll that's getting knocked out, you're just going to be able to draw three cards, get into stuff that you really need. You're never going to use its attacks, and it also has a retreat cost of one. So Absol, Oricorio, Jirachi, Mimikyu, all having that retreat cost of one means we can use Escape Board. So always good. So now as far as some of the supporters and the trainers, uh, we have Quick Ball. Quick Ball, just an easy way to search out your more Picos, your Jirachis, discard a card. We're okay with discarding. I have four Custom Catcher. Again, it's just there to be used. Uh, we have a couple Electro Power, a Reset Stamp, a couple Switch, Shrine of Punishment, Thunder Mountain, Cynthia, the big one, Professor's Research, uh, Marnie, Rosa. So, I mean, a lot of just staple for Volkner. Uh, with the set rotation, losing four Volkner is going to suck because you're adding Lily's Poke Doll. You're adding a energy to your hand. It's just a good card for the deck. And pretty much we've gone over the energy. So that's more Pico V. I love the deck. It's my favorite deck to use right now. It's just a fun deck to play. Uh, so we're going to hop on the Versus Ladder. I think it reset this week. No, 13 days it resets. So I think the prize, yep, Xerneas, GX, and the Full Art. I don't think I'll be able to get to it. It's a Diantha. Diantha's not that great. Not really worried about it. Mostly I'm just interested in getting the packs and the coins. Uh, what we want to cancel. Because we're playing Goons. Goons was the deck. I'm just going to forfeit. I'm not too concerned about. Uh, Goons is a different deck that I'm going to play. That will be in a separate video, probably Thursday. Not certain, but we're going to go into more Pico. So, Copperaja. That is not Copperaja V. That is just your standard Sun and Moon base set, Copperaja. So, that one is one I know I will try to uh, get a deck profile on because I love that deck. It is a very fun deck to use. So, hopefully, we can go 3 0. I do want to try to get three games in. Uh, kind of just that standard format like I used to have three games in hopefully win one hopefully win two go two and one That's always an advantage uh, For me three and oh is fantastic. Let me know what you guys think down in the comment section while I go three and oh two and one What will my record be? Also go don't forget to answer the question of the day uh, Let me know what decks you guys want to see I will try personally the best I can to build those decks for you guys uh, some of the decks like Dragapult V will be a little bit harder for me to to obtain. Um, so we're going to start off with the Jirachi. I used to have Sinchino in the deck, and then I bought the League Battle decks, and I replaced those with Jirachi. This is a deck I want to run, Toxtricity V. I would love to. Um, I have one from the tin, or not the tin, the promo box. Uh, I'm going to get rid of the Custom Catcher, and we're going to go grab ourselves a more Pico. Right off the bat, attach, attach, Stellar Wish, got ourselves a Pokey Doll. Oh, this is nice. So we got ourselves a Pokey Doll, we're gonna put on there. And then we're just gonna retreat. Um. See, that one I have to discard, which is not what I like. Uh, I'll get myself another Poke Doll. All right, so we got a couple Poke Dolls out on the bench. A couple Jirachi, got a more Pico. So, very solid opening right here. I'm very happy with this. He's going to play the Coco Prism Star. I would love to get a Coco Prism Star, hopefully. Uh, he's going to Pokemon Catcher here. Hopefully, he rolls a Tails. Okay, so he's not switching me in. Boss's Orders is a card I need to get. So, Boss's Orders pretty much just Guzma. Or not Guzma, Lysander. Um, so we're going to switch. We're going to get into Jirachi here. Uh, we're going to go for the VMAX. Now, we're going to Stellar Wish. See if there's anything I can get. I can get a Rosa. Doesn't help me. I can get a Marnie. Uh, doesn't really help me. Volkner gets me an item card and an energy. Um, I kind of just... You know, I'm going to go for the Marnie. Just so, one, I can sh get a brand new hand. I know it's going to help him. 
but I needed the new hand. Um, there's a Coco V. Coco V is nice. So we can go into this. Uh, we can get a Lucky Egg attached. Stellar Wish. We got Switch. Thunder Mountain. Ooh, Thunder Mountain's nice. Thunder Mountain's... I'm going to play it. It helps him in the sense that he can now attach an energy and use Electric Riot for 90. But now I can use uh, this. We want to attach. Um, we want this. I'm going to just draw three off of the Dance Tribute. There's that, so now I can technically just max discharge. What I want is a, I guess I'm gonna have to use Volkner. Because what is Electro Power? Is Electro Power 30 or 20? If it's 30, I can get a knockout right now. I'll grab this. Oh, he forfeited. Darn! Because all I wanted to do was grab an Electro Power. I think Electro Power is 30. I would have got the knockout because 180, 30. And pretty much he has a Coco Prism Star and a Magnemite. So that's 1-0 to start. Not the 1-0 that I wanted to get to, but um, I'll take it once we get a chest. Hopefully I can get a nice win streak going here. All right, so let's continue with this. So I know I would have gotten the knockout if I would have gotten Electro Power. Swapped out my Jirachi for more Pico VMAX. Picked up a knockout, and now his Coco Prism Star and his, um, what is it called? I think he had a Magnemite on the bench. So both of those would have 20 damage each. So we're in a decent spot. We're 1-0. We're taking on probably almost the same deck. Maybe he's playing... Uh, Toctricity VMAX, which I would love to play that deck so much. Easily one of my favorite decks. So good, we open Jirachi. I'm not worried about. Oh, we could also be playing um, Pika Rom. Just thought about that. We could be playing Pika Rom. So right off the bat, there's a second Jirachi. We're gonna Stellar Wish uh, for the Quick Ball. I should've got it. Okay, so Jirachi goes to sleep. We're gonna get ourselves a more Pico. We could reset stamp him. No, reset stamp's not the play right now. All right. So, that's fine. Jirachi stays asleep. I don't really care. Uh, I'm in a good spot. I got my Jirachis up on the board. I got my more Pico starting to get set up. He has a Wobbuffet. Wobbuffet. As long as this Pokemon, Prism Star, both don't have play. I'm not too worried about that because I'm. As, he has to assume I'm using Jirachi. So, here he's going to go for a Mysterious Treasure. Discard a Cynthia. And he's going to grab a... What is he going to grab? A Inke? Oh, dra oh, we're playing Dragapult. Okay. This is perfect. I've actually wanted to see how this deck plays. I know it's a very good deck. So, Jet Assault. And he has Horror Energy. And he's playing... Zigzagoon with it. Interesting. Interesting. What did he attach onto this thing? Big Charm. Oh, so, so he gets plus 30. There's the Oranguru. I could play Oranguru. I thought about it because I do have one. Okay. So Jirachi stays asleep. Unfortunate. Um, we're going to do this. Discard the reset stamp. We're going to search out... Probably Oracorio or Coco. I think Coco. I think Coco, because I do want to be able to draw cards. I want free retreat. We're going to do this. We're going to Professor's Research before I use Jirachi's ability. 
There's the VMAX, so I do want the VMAX in play. Uh, I want this. I want that. Now, we're going to Stellar Wish, hopefully find Electro Power, Custom Catcher, Volkner. Um, I'm going to get the Electro Power. Electro Power is actually not bad. We're going to retreat. We're going to get into my other Jirachi. We're going to Stellar Wish. Shrine of Punishment doesn't really help me. I'll get the Lucky Egg. Um, Lucky Egg because I can put it onto one of these. Uh, it doesn't look like he's going to damage me anytime soon. So that's actually not bad. Um... So Dragapult V actually reminds me a lot of Galissapod. Just looking at um, its attack, if this Pokemon is moved from your bench to your active, it does 80 more for a total of 140. Um, he's just going to go for the Marnie. Um, doesn't really hurt me. Nah, it didn't really hurt me at all. Uh, he's going to go for the Switch. He's going to get that uh, Dragapult in. Oh, he's going to get Jirachi in. So 210, 180. I need an Electro Power. I need Electro Power in him not to get a... Oh, as I hit the mic. In him not to get a... Um, Dragapult VMAX. Chaotic Swell. So he's going to play Chaotic Swell, so I can't play Thunder Mountain. Perfect. Oh, wait, no. That uh, Dragapult has 240 HP because of the item. So that's something I have to take into account. Uh, we're going to just go with Tapu Koko. We could, I, I'm just going to Marnie. I do need a new hand. I need an energy. Um, we'll just get rid of that. I don't care if Shrine of Punishment goes with it. All right. So we're going to use this. All right. Well, pretty much all I can do is get into that doll. Ah, oh, that sucks. Um, I'm gonna need memory energy now. I'm gonna have to uh, play. Is Rosa only get me a basic energy? Yeah, it gives me a basic energy. That's not good. And he's gonna Marnie. So I get a doll. Ooh, I get a Guzma and Hala. So Guzma Hala gets me Thunder Mountain and a Spinner and a Special Energy and a Tool Card. Okay, this actually is not bad. This is much better for me because I can play Guzmahala, get rid of the Quick Ball and the Custom Catcher, go get me the Special Energy and a Tool Card. Here comes Dragapult V, where he can put five damage counters anywhere he likes. I don't like that. And he's going to start setting up another Dragapult. Okay. So I'm seeing how the deck plays. You want to get the Dragapult VMAX set up. Chaotic Swell. Max Phantom's going to take me out. He's going to take out the other doll. Uh, most likely. Yep. So he wants both dolls gone. I'm going to draw until I have seven. Both dolls are out of the way. Now, I'm going to play this. Because I can play this. And I can play Guzmahala. So we're going to discard two cards, Custom Catcher and the Quick Ball. So now we get a Special Energy, which is the Memory Energy, the Tool Card, Stadium, won't matter, the Skateboard. All right, so we're going to attach the Memory Energy. We're going to attach the Skateboard. I can't really play Thunder Mountain. We're going to Dance a Tribute, hopefully get something to help me. It's not bad. All right, so Electro Wheel pretty much means we have to discard an energy, but I'm doing 150, and next turn I can still get a knockout. So we're just going to discard the electric energy. It's whatever. We're going to get into Lily's Poke Doll. So now... Still get damage, though, which sucks. 
because of memory energy. Or horror energy, that's what it is. Not memory, it's horror. Okay. So he only has 19 cards de left in deck. He's going through a lot of cards, which is good. I like him using up his cards, but I need to start making a move. There's the Max Phantom. He's going to probably put it on one Jirachi. Yep, so he's going to get a prize there. But now we're going to take out this thing. Custom catchers, which is nice. The, cust the two custom catchers will actually help me. All right, so we're going to max discharge. We're going to take out... Oh, it didn't take it out? Oh, that sucks. Oh, he has the item. Oh, I need to get that item removal card. I forget what it's called. Um, but we do have item removal right now, and I probably need to add that onto the deck. Because now he's about to do 130, 180... Not enough to take me out. But I think this is where the custom catcher can come into play. So boss's orders, he's going to switch Jirachi in. Oh, he's going to just do this for me. So he's going to pretty much put it to where I can severely cripple this Dragapult and heavily damage this thing. So we're going to go out into this thing. Use three. Um, I guess we'll start building this thing up. I don't want to use Dance Attribute because I'm only at 18. So we just max Discharge. We take out the Dragapult VMAX. I'm unfortunately going to have to take two damage counters worth. But he still can't knock me out. We do get Absol. We get three prizes from the VMAX being knocked out. He still can't knock me out. And... Oh my god, no! He has Malolana. That's 70, 120... All right, so Jirachi, so he's going to do 130, 180, put me at 290. I don't have anything really to overcome that. So we're going to place that. Catch that. Um, I can custom catch her and get the Dedene. Ooh, ooh. Okay, okay. Hold on, hold on here. I can get the Dedene knocked out. Sack off an Absol. Okay, 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 hold on. We got something here. We got something cooking. Now, the thing is, Dragapult can put five damage counters on there. I would need to... I need to get some boss's orders. That's what I need to do. Max dis... I mean, if I max discharge, I lose. So we're just going to Electro Wheel. I'm going to unfortunately... I'm going to just get rid of the memory energy. It's not going to help me. 180, that's what, 260? Recycle energy and Lily's Poke Doll. I do get a Poke Doll though. Oh, wait, no, he can just. I hate that Dragapult's attack, puts five damage counters on there. Um, he's going to Quick Ball, Search. I 
how many custom catchers? I only have... <gasps> ooh. Ooh. Actually, hold on. I think I know how I can win. I'm going to have to rely on me using Professor's research and getting two custom catchers. That's how I'm going to win. Because I think I only have two in the discard pile. Oh, I have three. Never mind. Okay. So that's not the way I can win. He's going to Marnie, which shouldn't affect me too bad, even if he uses it. Wait, I have Absol, so his Jirachi, he has to attach an energy before he can swap out. Oh, my God. S switch net. Is that what it's called? Switch net? Scoop up net. Okay, so... I need to take note for these cards that are being used. So these are cards I need to be adding to this deck. So scoop up net. So scoop up net. Yeah, I should be running at least two copies of that. So scoop up net. That's, that's actually a very good one to add. Um... Boss's orders. I do need a couple of those. Like three of those, probably. All right. So this will probably be the last game here. Hopefully we can go two and one. Uh, we, won the, we won the coin flip. So I did go three and oh on the coin flip. So scoop up net. Boss's orders are a couple mandatory cards. So we did brick here on the opening draw, which sucks. I'm um, trying to think of anything else that could be beneficial to the deck. Uh, scoop up net boss's orders probably pretty mandatory, especially over something like uh, what was that card? Custom catcher. <gasps> Ooh, we're playing Blacephalon, so bam! I'm immediately putting that down. Uh, we're gonna get rid of Mimikyu. I don't really care for Mimikyu. Um, I think we're just going to get this. Um, put this down. I'll use a custom catcher to draw a couple. All right. So, I mean, I do have some setup. Shrine of Punishment. As soon as I see that Blacephalon, glad I had Shrine of Punishment in hand. Immediately playing that down. So he's going to go for the switch. That's fine. He has a Drachi down. He's going to go for the Stellar Wish. So unless he gets a Stadium, um, uh, his Blacephalon's days are limited. Now, I do need to get my... What is it called? Why am I blanking? More Pico set up. So the quicker I can get more Pico set up, the better. Uh, not getting in it. I mean, I could Volkner next turn. Volkner for Lily's Pokedoll. I think would be actually a very good strategy for me. There's the scoop up net. Yeah. Yeah, that's that's a four of. That's a four of card. So there's there's the Blacephalon, Fiery Flint. He's gonna search for some energy. Discard two. Add four fire energy. And I am going to throw a random guess. He's gonna play a welder. Like, Welder makes Blacephalon a much better deck. So he's just going to attach, probably burn my uh, Coco. Just goes for the Burst GX. So he's going to search out for a prize card. All right, so we get another more Pico. I'm just going to go off with the Volkner. Um, and actually, I'm just going to attach that energy onto Coco. So one, I'm drawing. I want to draw cards. I need more cards in hand. So we're going to Lily's Poke Doll. We're going to play a more Pico. We're going to attach. And I'm just going to spike draw. One, I'm doing 20 damage. Okay, it's not a lot. But, I mean, I got Shrine of Punishment. So I've already done five damage counters through two, two turns. And three of those damage counters I haven't done anything for. I get another Volkner, which is nice. So that lets me 
search out another energy, which I need. And I'm just putting this Blacephalon GX on a timer. I have free retreat, so I don't really care. I can swap into Lily's Poke Doll right now if I want. Um, so we're gonna Volkner. We're gonna Lily's Poke Doll, and I'm gonna grab a Lucky Egg and an Energy. So we're gonna attach this onto there. I'm gonna retreat into this, and we're gonna attach this. So now we're pretty much just gonna stall out the Blacephalon. I feel really actually very good about winning this game. Especially if I can get a more Pico setup. No! That was the problem. Ultra Space. So now he can search out stuff like Naganadel and or Poipol and Naganadel, so he can have draw support. Um, now he's just going to mind blown, start getting rid of energy. Uh, this is not what I wanted. So there's the burn. 20. Burn goes away, so I'm okay with that. We're gonna play this. Looking at it, I mean, Guzma Hala doesn't help me. So we're just gonna end the turn there. I'm lucky, I think I actually have to be damaged by the attack, right? Yep. That sucks. There's him wasting energy. I mean, granted, I mean, Blacephalon players just play Fire Crystal, but I think he's already gotten rid of two. Three Fire Crystals gone. So really, I don't know. There's one. So there's his last Fire Crystal. That's kind of crazy that he's on his last Fire Crystal. Electro Power... All right, uh, I'm gonna Guzmahala. I'm going to discard Electro Power and Oracorio because I need the Lily's Poke Dolls against Blacephalon. Uh, I'm gonna get the Recycle Energy. I'm going to get a Skateboard and Stadium. I can't do anything about. So we're gonna attach, attach, and pretty much suck it up here. I need him to knock it out because I, I know he's weary of knocking out Lily's Poke Doll because then from there I get seven cards. I'm refilling my hand. I'm setting myself up nicely. Uh, this is where boss's orders would be nice. So he gets the escape board. I can knock out the Blacephalon if it ever goes to the active. That Blacephalon GX is active, it's gone, because I just go out into more Pico V, I use whatever the Electro Wheel is. Yep, Electro Wheel. Alright, so we're just going to discard this, we're going to get a nice full hand of seven. That's one custom catcher down. Uh, we're going to do this, and we're going to probably just grab me a Jirachi. Just prepare myself. See, this is where that scoop up net, scoop up net would be fantastic right now. <laughs> because I could pick up Coco V. Oh, wait, wait, I mess I think I messed that one up. I should have quick ball got rid of the energy. Eh. That's what I should have, I should have quick ball got rid of the energy. I got to think my place through. So there's the heat factory prism star. Ugh. So there goes that. So now I do have to attach. I mean, it's, it's not going to bother me that I have to attach. As soon as I attack that Blacephalon, I'm pretty much set game match. Because he has so much in here. He's already used four fire. Oh, he doesn't have much energy there. So this Blacephalon, discard any number of cards from your hand. This does 50 for each card you discarded. This has to go. 120. Hmm. He has energy retrieval. No, man, he has just a lot of energy returning resources. So I have to get rid of that Blacephalon. I have to make sure my more Picos are set up. 
So he's going to switch. He's going to go out into probably another Jirachi. Yep. Stellar Wish. Oh, gets a Welder. So now he's pretty much going to attach three energy onto his Blacephalon GX. And then draw three. So scoop up net, he's gonna pick up a Jirachi. Perfect, perfect. That's what I want. I want that Blacephalon gone. Cause all I'm gonna do is gonna go out into more Pico. He's already played a supporter this turn. He played Welder, so he can't boss his order me. I like that. He would have to play two There we go. Perfect. So we go out into this. This allows me to play another Lily's Poke Doll. Great. We attach. I don't need the Electro Power. We Volkner. So that I can get this and a Lily's Poke Doll. Or a Lucky Egg. We attach. We Electro Wheel. So what we're going to do now, we're going to get rid of this energy. We're going to go into Lily's Poke Doll. We have Recycle Energy back in our hands. Knocked out one Blacephalon. Good to go. There's the second Custom Catcher. Let's go. Perfect. Let's go. So now I can take out that other Blacephalon. And now he's in big trouble. Because one of his regular non-GX Blacephalon are prized. I love this. We're in fantastic, fantastic spot. Attach a third, a fourth off of the welder. Keep attaching those energy. Heat Factory G uh, Heat Factory Prism Stars. There we go. I'm happy about this. This is good. I'm in a very good, happy place right now. He's in a very bad place. So he's going to switch. What is he switching into? Probably the other Jirachi? No, Placephalon. Ooh. That doesn't matter. Because we're attaching. We are switching. We're going to knock this Placephalon out. We're going to switch. Perfect. All right, so this is pretty much game. We're going to discard the Recycle Energy. This is pretty much how Morpico wants to play. Morpico does not really care for the VMAX. Morpico wants to just be the regular basic V. So pick up a W to dare. We're going to get a prize ticket. Eh, could have been better. I've got a lot of those. Maybe I do a tournament stream one night. Uh, but if you guys enjoyed this Morpico V uh, deck, go ahead, hit that like button, guys. Don't forget to answer the question of the day. Let me know what decks you guys want to see. If you guys want to try this deck out, uh, I'm going to leave the deck list down below in the description. You guys can go ahead and copy it if you guys have the cards to try and play it. If there's anything that you guys would approve upon, also let me know that down in the comment section. Any misplays, let me know, please, guys, in the comment section below. I want to know how to play the decks better. Uh, if you guys see a mistake that I made that could have been played better that I didn't notice myself, let me know down in the comments below. I will always take criticism. With all that being said, guys, I am Johnny GB with the Token Minorities, and I'm signing out.